growing up, I was into street shit. Hustling out of Grand Marquis Caprice. People always told me I went. And welcome back to another episode of the Lit Podcast. And you know how we do it, you know what I'm saying? We be riding around the block, you know what I'm saying? You never know who we pull up on. But today, you know what I'm saying, in the city, you know what I'm saying, we bring you no other than, you know what I'm talking about, my boy Tweet Squeeze, baby! You were coming through, what's happening? That's the truth. What's happening, baby? I said, you up here, man. I say, I say, man, you hit me up. Say, man, I gotta get up there, man. You know, I gotta, gotta say my piece. Yeah, yeah, nah, yeah, yeah, you know, I get I get a couple of shout out of, you know, over here in the Soto or anything like that. Yeah, man, Gator Man gave you a big shout out, you know what I'm saying? Shout out Gator Man, you know what I'm saying, two times. Yeah, shout out to the tree of OG, man. Yeah, man. My city, man, you know what I'm talking about. You know what I'm saying, I want to start the podcast off by like, yeah, man, everybody make sure y'all join that live chat. Get in that live chat, the live chat is open. Every time this video pop up, the live chat is open. We're in there talking. You know what I'm saying? So if he in the live chat, you can ask him anything you want to ask him in the live chat or whatever. If you got anybody you want me to put up there, go in the live chat. You know what I'm saying? It's going down. But today we like to, you know what I'm saying, give grace and thanks and blaze and praise to my boy Mo Ink. You know what I'm saying? Before we get this thing started. You know what I'm saying? And all the fallen ones in D-Town. You know what I'm saying? Everybody been say Much love and rest in peace. You know what I'm saying? I want to say, you know... Well, let's go on and dive in there. Cause nothing to be real. Cause man. nothing to be real. Yeah, man. You know what I'm saying? I'm gonna have to light up to that shit. Yeah, we're gonna have to light up to that, man. We got everybody rolling blunts up, man. Mm hmm. Yeah, we're gonna have to light up to that, man. There you go. There you go. Hog in a blanket. Yeah, hog in a blanket. You know what I'm saying? That's what we call a hog in a blanket. You remember that? <laughs> so, man, let's start it off like this, man. Let's let's just go on down the man. <coughs> Where you from? <coughs> and who is? T squeeze. Okay, uh, you wanna know like before the T squeeze, uh, I'm gonna get to the T squeeze because I'm originally from Louisiana, you know what I'm saying? Shreveport, you know what I'm saying? Okay. Out the Cooper Road, you know what I'm talking about. So, you know, like 10, ten of my, my years, you know, it was another side, you know what I'm talking about. Then I moved to Dallas, you know what I'm saying? But really before that, I, before I actually left Shreveport, I moved out to Dallas and went to Daniel Webster. Okay. You know what I'm saying? My uh, first grade flunk. Then I had to regroup and go back. You yeah, yeah. So then I came uh, when I went back, got my shit in order. You know, as a youngin. You know what I'm saying? Changed names, stuff like that, and came back out here to Dallas. Okay, so what? what okay, so mm -hmm. we moved to the Soto. Oh, you moved to Soto, so that's where the stomping ground was at the yeah, Soto. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, so what school you went out there? You went to school in the Soto or anything? Yeah, yeah. You went to uh, Soto East? Went to East Junior High, went to North Side uh, for elementary and meadows. You know, they got amateurs and meadows. So the, the Soto really broke it down into two parts, you know what I'm saying, originally. You know okay. what I'm saying? Like, when the white flag was, uh, we was a part of that, you know what I'm saying? So we had, had uh, race fights and stuff like that. and. Uh, so we, they had to adjust to us, you know what I'm saying? Right, so they had to adjust, yeah. yeah so. <laughs> so we knew we knew boys moving in, you yeah, know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, so, <laughs> yeah. Yeah, and, and it was different though because it was different kind of, uh, you know, blacks or whatever. It was more so the ones that like, you know, uh, the, uh, not, not the uh, high class, but the mid-range, you know what I'm talking right. about? Right. So the mid class more so and then, you know, the apartments and we was the one I was the one in the apartments, you know what I'm talking about. Right, yeah, you so, know you always yeah. gotta have the ones in the apartments around the corner. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So it's that it's that that's the hood part of the game, but you know, all of it is it, is balanced. Right, you know what right. I'm saying? So you 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 come on this side of land, you know what I'm saying, this is a different region. When you come on this side of land, more so people at that time was trying to make something better. You know, right. you know what I'm saying? So that's what I'm a part of. So where did T-Squeeze come from, man? Where, where that come about? Well, T-Squeeze came from T-Square. Okay. You know what I'm saying? So T-Hall, T-Square, you know, different names, you know, throughout. So that one really kind of stuck with me. So when, like, E-40 was doing that e feezy Fonzery, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Too you know what I'm saying? Yeah. That's where T-Squeeze came from. Okay, man. for Sheezy, baby. Yeah. 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 So, <laughs> like, around 97, you know, it's my class. Class, shout out to all the class, 1997 DeSoto. Oh, uh, 97. You niggas going back, 97. You know so what I'm saying? My nigga, and my nigga, uh, my nigga Pete Perry. My nigga Perry, I can't, you know, I think his last name, but 
He was hustling for though, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like the high heel popper, you know what I'm talking okay, about? Okay, okay. Yeah, shout out to him, you know. He he was first nigga called me that shit, uh, T Square, and then my partner B Brad called me T Squoops, like that. So he rolling with that bitch and yeah. T Squeeze, you know what I'm talking about? T Squeezy. Yeah, so it came out yeah, T Squeezy, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, so, okay, so, yeah, I like that squeeze, range. You know what I'm saying? So they dropped the T, Squeeze. Right. So they came, I walked down the street with a hood on, I squeeze. I'm, I got damn. Who know? Who is this? You know what I'm saying? Who is this calling me? You yeah. know so. So the yeah. the fine T squeeze. You know what I'm saying? What is T squeeze about? You know what I'm saying? What is it? You know what I'm saying? Because I said you got a, you're a man of multiple hats. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? But so what you started out as? You know what I'm saying? Yeah. For people to you know, for you to start rubbing feathers with these names behind this music in Dallas. You know what I'm saying? Because I said you know a lot of people. Yeah. Uh, well, T squeeze really um. Is a, is a, I'm more I'm a a sports nigga, so I was a, a student athlete. Right. You know what I'm saying? But music go hand in hand with that. So I, I was out here kicking up dust. You know what I'm talking about? You know my cousin, you know they was on the other end kicking up dust. You know what I'm saying? But they were doing the music side of it. Even us, uh, my cousin, uh, Seven Dudes and Blowfly. You know, real real. A uh, seven dudes and both fly. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. All right. Too. Okay. Okay. Yeah, yeah. Shout out two times. Shout yeah. out to them boys, man. Yeah. Shout out to the side, East Dallas. You know what I'm talking about? But uh, yeah, like T Squeeze more of like a like a like a hoop or football slash. You know what I'm talking about? But I can use. I used to you know do the. I can do some moves and shit. You feel me? So I'm here and there. You know, so like a genie or, or ninja. You know, so I kind of had that mindset of a player, you know what I'm saying, like the top, you know what I'm saying, so it's always been the, the character of, oh yeah, the character of Bro T Squeezy, you know what I'm saying, just basically, just everything that we grew up on, you know, Dolomites and all that, you know what I'm saying, top, you got the Mac, all that, you know what I'm oh, yeah, saying, yeah, so yeah. It's basically you got to be on your, yeah, fly your shit, shit, you know player shit, yeah, yeah, uh, yeah Mac so, shit, you know yeah. what I'm saying, mm -hmm. just so, being on your shit, you know what I'm saying, so, that's basically what you know where it is with me on that. So when you call okay, so you saying blow fly, you know what I'm saying, seven deuce and all them your cousin, so Okay, so I know they've been in the mu mu uh, music heavy, you know right, what I'm saying? Yeah, Basically, yeah, when they jumped yeah. off, so like, okay, so what influenced you to start hanging around the music? You know, who you was growing up listening to that got you to start, you know, you know, want to be around this music like this? It go all the way back to uh, my first tape I got. My little brother, uh, Dad, had sent it to me, but I, I, my cousin had a rapper, a, a Run DMC rapper. We were playing that shit on, on Christmas one time, and uh. And I was just listening to that, and I was like, damn, you know, like rap, you know what I'm saying? At that time, it was the first of it. Then uh, I got that Elliot Cool J tape. <laughs> you know what I'm oh, saying? I'm which bad. one? I'm bad. Yeah, 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 man. Say, say, hold up, man. That shit did something to me. <laughs> yeah. I think that did something to all of us, you know what I'm saying? That shit struck gold on me, man, for real. For real, for real. Yeah, man, that was yeah, that was a bad that was a bad album right there, yeah, boy. Yeah, yeah, that was that was bad album, yeah. So yeah. who's in Dallas was you know what I'm saying, around and listening to or you was in the corner, you know, messing with at this time that was coming out? Well see, I'm like again, when I first came to to, to Dallas to the Soto, that's the tape I had, I had uh you know, T John played, I had that the other cool J, but T John played all kind of music when she was, you know what I'm saying? When we were going to sleep, uh, waking up, cleaning up, you know what I'm saying? But that that's, that's, that was the balance of, of, of my music, the bass of it, you know what I'm saying? Right. Hearing all kind of music, you know what I'm talking about? Church music, in church, you know what I'm saying? So church come, come a part of it too, you know what I'm saying? Uh, so just being around all that type of stuff, preaching and stuff like that, coming up from all that. But uh, the, the, like the first, like, but I like, but draw me, okay, see, see, I was on that, uh, like, eighth grade and shit like this here. I was on that, that, uh, that tell me something good, UGK, you know, just to hear them niggas sound like us, you know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Like, that would make me, like, really embrace, like, I ain't know how to do it at that time, you feel what I'm right, saying? Right. So, but I, it was like, it was an interest, you know, like, damn, like, I could hear, I could hear that country that, that southern like it was it was home it was home cooked meal. You know yeah, yeah, saying? yeah. Like, it was refreshing. It was a breath of fresh air. So I heard that, you know what I'm saying, as a child, ghetto uh, ghetto boy mind playing trick on me. 
that shit, you know what I'm saying, that did something to me. That was a transition in time uh, for us at, 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 of our time, you know what I'm saying? Right, so, right, it sure was. So, like, a lot of this that, uh, uh, kind of played a big part of it, too, with me. Who was out in Dallas then? Uh, was you hearing any music coming from Dallas then? Shit. I don't know if Tony Terry was from, you know what I'm saying? Uh-huh. But you know what I'm saying? That's yeah. the only, like, it, I, I ain't hear too much, like, oh, yeah, yeah, hold up, my father, my father, my father, my bed. Uh, <laughs> like, yeah, the feel fresh, you know what I'm saying? Uh-huh. The feel fresh, you know what I'm talking about? You, I heard all that, you know what I'm talking about? All that, that, that era, the nemesis and all that, that right. era, you know what I'm saying? Like, that was a part, you know, DJ Magic. You know what I'm saying? All that. And DJ they, Magic, what we yeah. tell Mike, they, they from Florida, though. Yeah. You know, he had that boom. But, but I know, but they yeah, had that they, boom. Yeah. But I'm saying that was the era. That was the era. That was the, that was the era. So, yeah, I know. So, so, I had that Magic Mike, too. Yeah. So, so <laughs> I'm just saying, like, who, yeah. whoever was had that same bass. Yeah. I, I, cater to, yeah. Yeah, yeah. so I, I got shit, like, you know, my shit came from, like, OG and shit. Right. right? Mm-hmm. If I liked it, then I'm, let me listen to that. You know, let me tell you, let me love that. You know, let mm-hmm. love that. Yeah. Oh yeah, that was the biggest thing, you know yeah, what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, 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 yeah. Them double take, you know what I'm saying? Dub like, tape, yeah, I, yeah. I ain't finna go buy this one right here. I want that copy now. Right, right, you know right. What I'm saying? Let me get that. Yeah, we come from that shit, and mm-hmm. and, 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 and uh, dubbing tapes and shit on, you know, BT rap shit like. Yeah, but you just brought me back on that dub and that tape stuff, yeah, one. yeah, yeah like, so for real. That's where I come from. Yeah. So all right, so how do you hook up with franchise player? What would that? What, I mean, you know what I'm saying? Like. What started that? Did you even know at that time too? Both Fly and them was rapping at that time? Yeah, too? they were real to real. So, when uh, Cotton Mouth, me and Cotton Mouth, so I heard that, that music, you know what I'm saying? So, what about the first time you heard Cotton Mouth and that music? That, that, was one, that was one of the first times. It was in um, Kill, Killer uh, J. Okay, Killer J. Okay. Both Fly. Okay. You know, the, All right. So, that, so, I heard that, you know what I'm saying? So, I, like, I heard. All the music that we that we you know come come on uh, you know okay. what I'm saying right but it's so much and um that's why I appreciate you doing this here because it's gonna tap into what we what we really grew up into right 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 and right everybody get to educate themselves go back and stuff like that you know what I'm saying but it was a lot of music that was circulating around you know what I'm saying you just had to put your hands on it you had to have a big brother big cousin. Big OG, big big uncle that they were jamming that shit. You right. Know what I'm saying. Okay, so how did you hook up with franchise player? Uh, franchise player, I hooked up with my cousins like <coughs> these niggas were little fool like you know what I'm saying. We ain't that much apart, but you know what I'm saying. We, they were they were younger than me, so I seen. Uh, I know how, I know what you mean. Yeah, yeah at uh-huh. that time. So, but they were dancing. They be at family union dancing. I always rapping like. But T Rock and, Lil, and Joe Cool, that's what I'm gonna call them. That's, okay. the, that's the first name. Okay, T Rock and Joe Cool. Yeah, okay, yeah, now yeah. we got it. Okay, yeah, yeah. yeah. So that that so you know I'm Brian. So they T Rock and, and Lil Joe and Lil Mike. You know what I'm saying? So that that they had something early. You you already seen that shit. You know what I'm saying? So family unions were when we got older. When when Fro got out or whatever, when he was locked up. You know what I'm saying? He spent some time. When in the youth until he got like by 21. Right. So about six, seven years, I, I believe. And um, shit, we went to the family union. Mo, he was like 15, 16. Had that, he had that work. Yeah. Boy, had that work, man. Yeah. And yeah. I seen it at the family union, you know what I'm saying? Like, and I had the camera, you know what I'm saying? I got it on tape, so you know what I'm saying? When we created it, like, like what we were just, you could see us whipping it up, you know what I'm saying? Had something in that pot. Kid folk came, seven dudes they made at home from, he was locked up at the time, he came home, and on, he was at the halfway house. So, you know, like he seen it, but he, you know what I'm saying? He, he couldn't do nothing with it because, you see what I'm saying? He seen right, it, but right. he, didn't, he didn't understand it. Right, right. Because it was something fresh. Right. But, well, we got already had his, his foot in the door, though, with it. we didn't even know about it. Mm. So that's so that's with Solo, oh, Solo okay. and, and um and Puncho. Oh, okay. So we was over there at Staff P. I mean, we was over there before Staff P. And got the 
You know what I'm saying? So, so oh, yeah, so, okay, was, okay, okay. So it wasn't too. It, I really don't know. I, was, but I know they wasn't. Uh, they came like right after us, though. Right. You know what I'm saying? And um, Solo had more interest in in it with Moe. You know, shout out to my nigga Solo. You know what I'm saying? To the time. Yeah. He was. He, and we were signed. To, we really were signed to him because he got the lab called franchise or uh, records with a Z. You know what I'm saying? So back then. You know what I'm saying, doing shows and stuff like that. And um, but yeah, Mo he really had so Mo Inc. was kicking up dust. Then he got got into uh, a, a deal with, with Puncho. So Puncho introduced him solo. Solo was like, who was that young nigga? I mean he just loved pretty you know what I'm saying? Uh, come over here. So solo so he was making like about ten songs with the nigga. And then so he he kicking up dust around that time and uh he made he making a name for himself. Right. You know what I'm saying? So when he making a name for himself, she punch him on the back over there, you feel what I'm saying? So Okay, he, so what so what label Puncho had? Uh Dream Circle. Dream Circle. Yeah, okay. Yeah, okay. Yeah. okay. All right. It was the studio. I can't remember the uh The label. The label. But that was the studio, yeah, Dream Circle. Yeah, okay. Yeah, so that was behind Grandis over there, you know, uh On Keys? Yeah, yeah. Okay. Yeah, all right. Yeah, all right. Yeah. All right. Okay. All right. That's yeah, what Gator was talking about. Yeah, yeah, that's yeah. what Gator was talking yeah, about. Yeah, yeah, all right. Yeah. Bet. Okay. Shout out to Bo Lid. Yeah. Shout out to Bo Lid, yeah. man. Two yeah. times, man. For yeah. real. Yeah. He a real one too, man. Oh, no, no. Facts. Yeah. That's big, facts. Big facts. Yeah. yeah. Big facts. Yeah. <laughs> you know. So I kind of that's that's who I saw. I seen him. Uh huh. Seen what like what he had going. You know what I'm saying? So I'm both. I'm like the one on the sideline. So I'm just seeing from both sides, though. You know what I'm saying? You know, my cousin them, they stayed in their studio though. That's one thing they did, they stayed in their studio. I, I had to work and shit like this. You know what I'm saying? Hey, younger brothers, you know what I'm saying? So I was taking care of uh, you know, the household too, so. But uh, them niggas stayed in their studio, man. And that's how franchise players arrived. You know, mm -hmm. that was the birth of it, you know. It's a little bit more, you know what I'm saying, into it, but. That was the base of it. Yeah, the like base of it, yeah, yeah. Uh -huh. yeah, and put it together. Yeah, so. so around this time, all right, so what, what was what, what what was the moves? What was the moves to getting y'all moving around and getting y'all name, getting y'all name circulating? Well, shit, what, uh, back then in them times? Right. Okay, well, I, whatever happened with the situation with Mo Inc. and, and the Froze, we saw Lil Puncho at that time. He 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 spun off into the bow leg hand. Right. You know what I'm saying? So they was on there. They had a CD that they were supposed to drop with with Stampede called "Who Stole My Mojo" or something like that. It was on. It's in, it's inside the cover of Stampede. Uh huh. So that's when during, throughout that time is when they started rising. And right. They end up going to uh, franchise players. You know what I'm saying? Well, I mean, going to be with a record with with franchise with the franchise players game. Right. Well, uh, Rizzo. Rizzo. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, and 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 from there they was they were cooking in. You know what I'm saying? Right. You, you, yeah. That, that's when. So like we kind of like hey broke apart like that. Me more so to the street side, and they was with the music side so, and traveling. You know right, what I'm right, so, right. So you didn't get to travel, you didn't get to experience none of the. No, I did a couple of shows like here. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Right. And deep elements stuff like right. that. Right. You know that's the you know that's the circuit. Yeah, that's, yeah. that's the chicken circuit. You know what I'm saying? Square bit. You know yeah, you don't touch nothing yeah, down yeah. there. You ain't did nothing. <laughs> yeah, 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 man. Like I, I, like I said, I, you know, I'm more so in the sports though. So I was still connected with the sports. I was playing like celebrity games, stuff like that, with, with some, with some, uh, with some people too. Are you uh, playing celebrity games? Yeah. What type of old games you were playing? Like basketball. Okay. Yeah. All right. All right. Mm -hmm. So, what's up with these celebrity games? Were they like events or these actual games? Yeah, he was. He was. Uh, he was game, but you know, like shout out to my nigga Big Hood. You know what I'm saying? Okay. So he hit me up. You know, this, this was. Little, little, you know what I'm saying, little, uh, after that, but you know what I'm saying, I'm just saying, like, throughout that time, I've I been playing in all-star games, shit, I played in all-star games in, in uh, TJC when I was in college. Okay, okay, yeah, 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 Tyler Junior College, yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. Out there with uh, Pete Craig, Patrick Craig, 
Okay. We went to high school. Pay first shout out to Patrick Pay Pray too. Ah, really? I mean, you know, I saw, so you so you been around some yeah. Okay. Yeah, on both sides. Right, both sides. Right. Yeah, right. Yeah. Okay. So I. Right. Why, that's why that ball player we we resonated with that ball player. And then going to the franchise. Right, right, right. I see, I see the, I see just a resilience. You yeah. know what I'm saying. So we, although that, that's another thing, we was in at the family reunion. So we was just flowing like, uh, my wing got an older brother named uh, Lil Mike. Uh huh. You know what I'm saying? Lil Mike was making beats back then, so okay. he had like about three, four beats, four beats, something like that. And we were rapping on them beats. Our family reunion, the whole family reunion, the room. We was in the room, just nonstop going. Back, right, just, right, right, right. It's going back to back and forth, back and forth. You know what I'm saying? Our little cousin, that's that's on like on the rise right now. They were sitting back watching, so it was almost like as you see, it switch a house, but it was a family house. Right, you know right, 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 right. So like, and it was just that was like that portion of them children was was these ones. You feel me? Like right. they were gonna be the ones to be reckoned with. So. They like shout out to BJ as Rod Slim too, you know what I'm saying? He that's my only brother too, the little Chris. Out there. Yeah, he, he, well, he rapping yeah, right, yeah, um, yeah, he kicking up dust, like like proud of him. Proud of him too, mm -hmm. I, like he he totally opposite. Told the totally opposite, you know what I'm saying? Like he, he you know he uh he a real professional with it, you know, he handled his business, he on time with it, he you know what I'm saying, he, he his music is is representing for a culture. Right. You know what I'm saying, that we've been missing. It's a breath of fresh air. And what that ain't the one that ain't the same one that was performing for the baby thing, was it? Yeah. Yeah, the same okay, yeah, all right. Yeah, that's that's right. Yeah, okay, that's just making sure, you know what I'm saying? That was at the hub, right? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I see he I see he set the roof off on there, huh? But when uh now nah, he was at the uh DJ Fleet week, so it was DJ from Miami DJ. Uh huh. They all was over and it was a bunch of DJ Houston, uh, one of the Houston DJ was hosting it, and then you know, Baby was hosting it. You okay. Know what I'm but I had another uh, act came from uh, Washington, you know what I'm saying? Light skin and kick folks up there, man, up, up there by the mountains and shit, by the, by the, the rules and shit, like this. Yeah. <laughs> but, uh, but they was down here and they tore that bitch up, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to Tay Crucial and Sid Bash, man. Yeah, two times. Yeah. Yeah, for real. And they 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 opened they they woke baby up for real. And then so the height of how they did it, they were early. So Kinfo it died down by the time Kinfo got on, but his music right there with. It. So baby over there eating. Uh, Jody Breeze and my his baby wife out they over there eating. You know what I'm saying? Food. Kinfo got out there uh, did the eighty seven fleet and the Leah. Shit, they let me go there. So they baby they them rocking. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and then they was just gliding with that shit, you know what I'm saying? Just, you know what I'm talking about? Just gliding, you know what I'm talking about? And then uh he even shout out Fro and them. The nigga got the night that them niggas rocked that bitch, nigga got the ninety three gas in the chamber over there. <laughs> you know what, yeah. what I'm talking about? <laughs> so yeah, man. He yeah, that was love like, right like, there. Yeah, yeah, baby told me, like, man, y'all let this nigga come up here and rock rock this bitch to sleep or something like this, man. <laughs> yeah, yeah, he woke them niggas up, man. Like, oh, really? And then they came at, at the end of the uh, show, like, man, the damn they brought tears in the eye, man. Like, keep up, whatever inspired you, keep keep it up. Like, these niggas, we don't even know coming up to them saying this. Right. But it was, it's, it's music player, it, it's... It ain't, it ain't, you don't hear it that often, you know what so I'm saying? So what is the, what is the circle you? The circle you, man, is, is right, this particular time, it's a, uh, it's an entertainment uh, company, you know what I'm saying? So hustle turn hobby, hobby turn hustle, you know what I'm saying? Just to the, to the, uh, work and put it into the muscle, you know what I'm right, saying? Right, so, right. But the circle you is, is, is basically, it's, a, it's family oriented. Right. You know what I'm saying? So child players, it, um, it just basically came like the love, like Cuz say, I always talk about love, love. That's what's missing in the world today. Right, the love. The love. The love, the love is missing. The love is gone, man. Yeah. <laughs> For real. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? They're trying to bring it back, you know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, you gotta bring it back, you know what I'm saying? Because it's out there, you know what I'm saying? Um, yeah. You know, shit, it ain't hard to find. For real. But if you ain't looking for it, you know what I'm saying? You gonna miss it. For real, for real. You know what I'm saying? So who is so who is the circle you? So the circle you, you know, it started with uh, well, it started with us like back so, 2009. So when my cousin was doing that thing, this one I tell y'all I'm doing mine. You mm -hmm. know what I'm saying? So, so it was the build up of the uh, circle you back then. 
and um, who all was, affiliated with it. It's, you know, that, that just it started as a neighborhood thing, right. you know, and my little brothers, you know what I'm saying? So, three different generations, but so friends and partners that's, mm -hmm. that's the elites, you right. know what I'm talking about, or the elites. So, it's pretty much them, because we all like family, you know what I'm saying? It's, it's family oriented. Like, some people might be some kin folks to somebody, you know what I'm saying? So, it's like a circle. Right, so you gotta say, yeah, so what you just gotta hold in this neighborhood. Yeah, just, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? So, they, they, this was growing. So, like, the little ones now, some of them 18, 19, you know what I'm saying? That right. I grew up. So, you know, just just really, like, it's some, it's some shit that you ain't. You ain't really accustomed to seeing, but it's there though. You know right, what I'm saying? Right. But, but it take a, a, a brilliant mindset to do it. Almost like it's almost down to like uh, Phil Jackson mm -hmm. when, with, when he had to do uh, fuck with the Bulls. You know what I'm saying? Putting that shit together. You know what I'm saying? Coming up with, with a lot of nothing, but turning into something. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But everybody is somebody. Right. Right. Just, right. Just basically making them. They don't see it though. Something right. like something. I'm talking about like a lot of people. Really don't see the talent that I always have, though. You know what right. I'm saying? I'm like, damn, these niggas doing what what rapper be rapping about. You know right. what I'm saying? These niggas doing whoop whoop, and they over here with. You know what I'm right. saying? So we build our own culture. You know what I'm saying? So, so they so the, so I ain't even cut y'all. Are you good? Like my brother, Wayne. He was. I put more more into him about this rap shit because I thought he was gonna be doing doing the rap shit. He uh. So him and him and Rainwater they hoop it up one time and battle. You know what I'm saying? Rainwater was rapping that. You know how we rap out here in Texas, right? And it was some niggas rapping some other kind of way. So I was you like, talking about Rainwater rapping. Yeah, yeah. Ra uh, Rainwater battle rapping. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. He was up there, but he um he was doing so. I was big, my little brother. Like man, I knew he was he was kicking up dust at the crib and shit, and with his partner Young Tay now. They did a whole mixtape called Off the Head. Shout out to Young Tay too, man, for real. And uh Two Time. Two time with Shout out to Two Time. Two yeah, time. Yeah, two time, yeah. Shout and, out to and, 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 and Two Time, they are my brothers, you know what I'm saying? And, okay. And uh Two Time and, and, and Young Tay, they kinda like up there with me. Right. You know what I'm saying? Right. Shout out to Vincent Brown too, so it had like a whole little old click called Crash Dummies, Off the Head, uh all them little different titles, but so that's where it stemmed from, you know mm -hmm. what I'm saying? Like, but my brother was cold with it, he was rapping, and then he got the rapping up and hoop it up, and then that's like kind of like the inspiration of a lot of uh, that, 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 that music for them came, from, you know, for me, to, I seen it in him, right? But I seen what they were doing, like Rainbow, I seen the nigga was up there. Rapping at, at the 97.9 booth, you know, that was first, uh, when 97.9 first had jumped out. You okay. know what I'm saying? So, but, but I ain't had So, who on the bottom? See, who around that battle? See, my little brother. So <laughs> he he said, that my brother. He, 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 he was like, I rap. He, he said, Ray, who won that battle, Ray? He said, he said, he said, he said, he said, I rap, but yeah. I won't, I won't battle. Uh -huh. You know what I'm saying? And that's what he did. He got to hitting them punchlines up there. You know what I'm yeah. saying? Ice birds, speedy guns out. You want to see a dead body? Watch the boys in the hood. You know what I'm yeah. saying? That type of shit to cry. Ooh, ooh, because they ain't heard that shit. Right, you right. You know what I'm saying? So that's why I say he, he, cause he, brought, it, he brought another kind of flavor. Another you know twist what I'm saying? Over, so yeah. That's what the circle is. You okay. know what I'm saying? It's the, the ones that doing but we It's more so that cafeteria. How big is this circle, man? Because this, this circle sound big, man. man. You know what I'm saying? Man, what? Man, I'm saying. I'm man. I'm saying. I'm you got a big <laughs> circle. Godly. Yeah, look, I brought my people with me. You know he said, nigga, say, I brought my people you know with what me. You I brought my people with me, man. You know what I mean? This is how you got some. Okay. Yeah, yeah. You got oh. some, yeah, you got some you know what I'm saying? HPIC, you know what I'm yeah, saying? It's, 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 like, this is really mm -hmm. a fit our way around here. Oh, okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Like, hey, this is, yeah and you do all the artwork. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, you do all the artwork. Yeah, you this ain't even art, though. This, yeah. this, this, that's pen. Yeah. 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 So the, to the canvas, mm -hmm. the autograph, you know what I'm saying? So anybody for a week, you know what I'm talking about? I see. We, hey, we made it. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? 
They say we made it. We made it. We don't hear them. We in there. We in there like swimwear. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But yeah, you know what's up. What you got up in there, man? You got like a whole bunch of like. Man, just just artwork, man. Just man. kind of like compilation. Like, like the only way you could get compilation from me, you know what I'm saying? I mean, for me, it's through me. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, Same yeah. way, I'm at the trunk with it. So, exactly. You know? exactly. You would keep so, that old school hustle. Yeah, that yeah, old yeah. school hustle ain't going nowhere. Yeah, yeah that, this is yeah. my king. This is my producer. Shout out to JK, okay. man. So All he right. was on the west side. Remember, I, mean, I said oh. two different sides. He right. was on the mm. west side thing. But him and Rifleman, shout out to Rifleman. Man, shout out Rifleman. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, Real to real. Man, I see Rifle Man over there, they all over there. You know, they that's real to real. They got the rock star going on, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. So them two were producers, they went downstream, so they took the downstream to the real to real. And so he was he was with them, so he had JK had, uh, okay. So JK one of the first ones to have like a, a, a project an album did in the Soto. Of our time. Oh, uh, okay. Like a start to finish complete. You uh, know okay. what I'm saying? And a producer. He, right. So he made him and Rifle, they were making music back then. So yeah. So Easter. Yes, Drew. Yeah. So yeah, then I got this one here. This, this, uh, this I went up to Washington, you know what yeah. I mean? You know what I'm yeah. saying? Yeah, the vision clear, Washington's to Texas. T E X U S. What's that? Bally Ho? Bally Who. Oh, uh, who? Okay. Yeah, yeah. yeah. The circle, you in the table, Bally Who, no pee, no pad. You know what I'm saying? So it's basically like well, the culture of it. You know, so like when when the freestyle died down, everybody thought the freestyle was dead. They say he brought it back. Nah, it was still over there cooking. Like, yeah. we, no pee, that was our thing, no pee, no pad. You know what I'm saying? All the youngsters, like, uh, coming up in the, in the ranks. On the football field, Marcus Murphy, and them, you know what I'm saying? Von Miller, that we was the ones that they we were talking about them. We were promoting them through our music. Uh -huh. You know what I'm saying? Like, okay. they was going back, jamming at the school. <coughs> so, a lot, of, a lot of our world play, they took it back to the Soto. Mm -hmm. And them kids and stuff were saying our shit. Right. You know what I'm saying? So, Sleeping and all that, this shit came around the corner, man. Yeah. Boy, I ain't heard to do all that. You yeah, know what I'm saying? But, <laughs> you know, like, it's just certain things we, we you know, we, we pioneer. But shout out to my uh, nigga, Take Crucial, though. He helped me develop another sound to, to get my feature, uh, you know. You know, I took myself to arts development. You know, I've been, you know, paying and everything, but it never was a completion of always completing it all the way through. So. This was all the way through by myself. Already, you know already. And I left to go to Washington. I knew people back home don't want to hear what I did. Right, and right. So this is, this is that one. Already. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. this the one that's like, damn, you did what? You, you went no pen, you, you didn't stop, you didn't punch in? Okay, yeah, that's off the top. <laughs> so this was that. You know, shout out to Take Crochet and say Badge up there. You know what I'm saying? And, uh, no bother. So you're coaching. I see you yes, got the coaching going on. Yes, sir. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like sports my first love and, and I you know, like I said, I went to T J C, you know, went to go uh be a, a teacher and a coach, you feel me? And you know, I wasn't focused, man. I wasn't focused on that shit, man. I was away from the crib first time, had an apartment first time, and you know what I'm saying? Maybe do what the fuck I want to do first time, man. See, like, <laughs> see, everything was first time, got there. Like, yeah. it was just wild and out, yeah. you know what I'm saying? Wild hot. <laughs> so, that, that's where, you know what I'm saying, the love of this, you know what I'm saying, comfort, you know, giving back to the kids and right, stuff like right. that. Ain't nothing like getting back to that youth. Yeah, yeah. And then I'm putting my 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 yeah. part of the game back into it. Like, yeah. In their vein, you know what I'm saying? Like I'm teaching them shit that's gonna get them out ready to the, you know, to the top. You know what I'm saying? I know what it takes. So handles and shit like that, shooting the defense, running backs, cornerback, quarterbacks, receivers, kickers, punt, whatever, you know, like I do the psychology part of it. Okay. You know what I'm saying? You know, it's like strike college, I earn my strike on the street coming. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Well, yeah, this is it. I do cancer stuff, so that's where they come from. All right, that's much respect right there. Appreciate there you. more people out there getting more out to them kids and doing more for the youth, yeah, you know what yeah, I'm saying? Yeah. It ain't yeah. nothing like it, you know what I'm talking about? I ain't even started them with the music yet, so yeah. you know what I'm saying? I'm keeping them, trying to keep them driven with, with the, uh, you know. Right, you, yeah, you know what I'm saying? Because they're going to find it. Right, they gonna, yeah, they're going to find it, especially out here. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? And this, you know what I'm saying? Like, this is... My pioneer 
you know, the brand, the logo, you know what I'm saying? So you see this, you know? It's us, man. Oh, shit. Fuck all this, man. Say, so, you know, we're going to see you in court. <laughs> <laughs> you know what I'm saying? This, you know what I'm saying? So, <laughs> he said, don't take that shit. <laughs> yeah, yeah. You ain't said true because it, 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 downtown, yeah. Yeah, yeah. I see. You got yeah. the mic for the ball, the yeah. Dallas ball for the mic. Yeah. Been yeah. Breaking records. Yeah, the breaking records. Yeah. Yeah. We've been breaking records. See, you know, <coughs> That, so the one the mic going in there through that through that with the fish like like this, we want it like it's, it's showing you like we 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 gonna do our thing you know what I'm saying we gonna represent it correctly uh, really. you know and we always have you know what I'm saying so that's kind of like pretty much uh, that you know what I'm saying so man so who so our so who, who what groups and stuff you used to be a part of okay well uh, you yeah, like so with with the circle. You got two times, you got Big Shot, you got YN. Then we had a, a rap radio. So it was uh, my nigga Joe Blow. What did do Joe Blow? Shout out to Joe Blow, man. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like he made, the, he built it all the way around for, you know, this year around for me. Right. We could play our music, so we had to do it on the internet. You know what I'm saying? We did that on the internet before the podcast game was popping, you know what I'm saying? Like we really had this shit going for real, like all the colleges, the D, D1 colleges and little chicken circuit colleges, man, we had all that shit on lock. And they had hand over hand. Uh, yeah. The CDs, yeah. I had, I was giving them CDs. Yeah. Yeah, so, there's a lot of no pen, no pads out there. You know, uh, so that's where I come from. Like, I always just been myself doing my own thing. You know, but the group wise, I come from franchise players. And that's just that's just what I stood on. Right, stand and, on that. Yeah, yeah in, in third ward, like we inside the school, like we was fools in school, but you know, third ward, that, that's my that was my like a brotherhood. Right. Yeah, besides besides the family. Yeah, what's the third ward? Yeah, so it's like when Master P came out with uh, about it. Uh huh. Yeah. Okay, so you actually yeah. you actually yeah. fuck so, with the third yeah, war, third war. Okay. Right, right, right. right. So we just created our own third war. Right, right. Within our, you know, within our system. Right. And it was, and we made our own movie too. Like back then, like ninety eight, we made like an unbattled two. Right, right, right. Okay, right. so it like we really like took a liking to the to the culture of what P had started. Right, you right. You know what I'm saying? That's one of my heroes, you know what I'm saying? So Master P, J. Prince, you know what I'm saying? Just just putting, the, you know, I took a little documents out of the day, you know what I'm saying? Walk of life. And uh, the, the, uh, yeah, the third world, yeah. you know what I'm saying? I understood it was real, you yeah. know, it was real. Like, cause, you know, seeing him come from Louisiana, that what gave me this spark. Like, if I want to do this, I, it's, it's there for me to do it. You yeah, know I think saying? I think everybody took a little uh, piece out of uh, yeah. Master P chapter book, you know what I'm saying, out of them books, you know what I'm saying. So, so what you got going on right now, man? I see you got the health as wealth, you know what I'm saying. Ooh, I see you man, in the streets, hey. you know what I'm saying. I see you got the merchandise going yeah, down over here. The ship, man. Yeah, you know what I'm saying. Then I see I see you got the medical, you know what I'm saying. Yeah, like, man. <laughs> hey, Jack, I'm here. Like, yeah. Like, you know, like, I got, uh, one, you know, like, probably, like, I think it was, like, 2008. No, not, yeah, yeah, about eight, 2008, you know what I'm saying? Nigga, nigga working at Wheeling Wild Mart, working another job, working two jobs, you know what I'm saying? And, uh, nigga got sick, you know what I'm saying? Eating, eating bad and shit. So, I kind of, like, start, uh, you know, just like receiving like what I'm putting inside, you know what I'm saying, in my like my system, you know what I'm talking about, like what we eating and stuff, like intaking what you know, just caution being cautious on, on what I really do and just knowing what I did and what it made me trigger off, you know what I'm saying, with diverticulitis, you know what I'm saying? It's like an intestinal low situation. And so that shit happened back in the gap, so I you know I started doing research and all stuff like you know I was fucking with uh, Dr. Sabi. Oh yeah, Dr. Mm -hmm. Sabi, yeah, yeah, Dr. Sabi, yeah. yeah. Before like before everybody started fucking with it, man, mm -hmm. like real talk, I was you know just on my shit, you know what I'm saying, discovering some shit, you know what I'm saying. Then he blew up, you know what I'm saying. But just some of his stuff and then researching stuff that that fell into my mix, you know, and black seed all fell into it. You know what I'm saying? Sea mouse fell into my mix. Oh, yeah, sea mouse. So yeah. Different vitamins and stuff like that. Uh, you know, even got beard products, you know what I'm talking about? 
got your beard to grow right, you know what I'm talking about? I've been pioneering the beard for a minute too. Better ask somebody. Just like you see how these beards walking around here. Straight up, no cap. No cap. You know what I'm talking standing on there like Oh, yeah, side. but that beard, I got the beard gang around this motherfucker. All my people. <laughs> yeah. After you, you know them niggas from where I'm from. Yeah. They got that beard. I yeah. love every nigga around me. You yeah. know what I'm talking about predominantly. You know what I'm saying? It's, they come from me. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Yeah, uh, really? so, yeah, so that, you know, uh, the lotion and body wash and, you know, nasal pure, you know what I'm saying? For that COVID 19, got that, uh, that nasal pure, you know what I'm talking about? Yeah, he's a, he said, he said, so, 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 so I see you, you a hustle. Yeah, you're certified. Yeah, yeah. You know yeah. what I'm saying? Like, the, you know, they try to, you know what I'm saying? I'm just, I'm just here to say this, man. I am, I am that. Right. You know what I'm saying? I come from that. You know right. what I'm saying? Like when, when you don't, when you don't know where you come from, right. and then when you really find out where you come from, right. they make you embrace it. Right. You know right. what I'm saying? Right. So I embrace that. Click full of hustlers. You know what I'm saying? Family full of hustlers. You know what I'm saying? Came over and said, "Man, that nigga hat for sale." You know what I'm saying? Man, shit, I got some. Ooh, over here, man. But I'm, that's a little later. You know what I'm saying? But. Uh, like, like I said, you know, my pops are hustling, my T-John, you know what I'm saying? My T-John had me at an early age, 14 years old. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Yeah, so y'all grew up together. Yeah, you know, I grew yeah, up. I know, I, I know, yeah, I know yeah, I yeah. So I would put a cannibal in, you know, and responsible at an early age. So right. When I moved out here, I came in here with change. You know, Miss Vice, shout out to Miss Vice, or I pity Miss Vice. My grandmama, uh, Betty Jean, best friend. You know okay. what I'm saying? You know, when the vinegar jar full of change, uh -huh. full of change and dollars, you know yeah. what I'm saying? So I was already was business oriented just to know how to put it together as a uh -huh. business. You right, know what I'm right. saying? So, you know, uh, but I come I come from that and uh, you know, see I want everybody to know like you ain't gotta just you ain't gotta be narcotics you say, you know what I'm saying? Like you take the same hustle that you gonna flip with narcotics, whip in the kitchen with yeah. narcotics. You do it with something that they can move like some narcotic. Right, right. You feel what I'm saying? So message. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Check. <laughs> you got you got a message. You got email. Yeah. Type of shit. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> For real. So what what can we be looking forward to, man? What, what we got? What, what man? What teeth we got in the mix now, man? Uh, you know what I'm saying? Oh, I see okay. you over the Walker Feathers with Gator Man and everything. Y'all behind the scenes Dang, doing big man. things. Same, you know what I'm saying? Same, I see Froze Only over there back Ooh. shooting the videos. Oh, yeah. Everything's coming out looking good. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, man. So I'm, I'm, I'm just the, I'm the nigga doing. I done took that 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 middleman role. Right. And that's where I'm at with it. I, right. I done bridged the gap with the middleman role. Right. I'm just trying like my my biggest thing is. As a, I'm an A and R now. This is what okay. I got, really got going. I'm a full time videographer. You know what I'm saying. So these are the things I really do. Like, uh, like they call me phone. I do this with the whoop. So I, that's what I'm, I'm on. But I'm an A and R with Rebel Entertainment, and I'm working with uh like a lot of uh, black businesses and entrepreneurs and uh, designers. So I'm helping them, you know, like I'm a, a big brand ambassador, basically. Okay. You know what I'm saying? Okay. So, bet, bet, yeah. Bet. So that's what I do. Like I hustle somebody's brand, okay, get them bet. to to the people that need to. Right. Uh, right. Right. Uh, right. So street team. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. 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 <laughs> so that's what I. Yeah. Do. So real entertainment. Shout out to State of Mind, see some man. Shout out to my nigga Prime man. Shout out to my nigga, you know, Military Sergeant, man. Okay. Rebel Entertainment, shout out to, you know, uh, 93 Gas, shout out to, you know, all them, you know what I'm saying? This, but it's, I'm, my nigga Jack Cannon, you know what I'm saying? Okay, Andrew Jack Media Cannon. Galaxy, that's me. Six Real, that's the little baby brother of, of Andrew Media Galaxy, you know what I'm saying? My graphic designer, Josh, you know what I'm saying? That nigga go hard, you know what I'm saying? You know, Ice Boy, shout out to my nigga Ice Boy too. Like, so these are people that's been in a way, you know what I'm saying, youngsters in a way that was doing their thing kind of like before me. Shout out to Slim Swive, Vincent McKinney. Yeah, that's somebody that, that's, that's a part of me. Like, okay. I've been here uh, more than that nigga. That's, that's a fool right there. Right. He's he a fool, he next. He, he next, he next. I see. So, so what you got? What you got laying up for the next five years, man? What's the next plan? What's your plans for the next five years, man? Okay, uh, you know, just to just to just to be a dispense, just get a, have a dispensary. 
You understand me? Uh, okay. Yeah, I, I ain't, yeah, yeah, yeah. Dispensaries, uh, you know, at least uh, if it ain't having one, it's just like you know, doing my thing with them. You know what I'm saying? It's for like what, whatever somebody else need. You know what I'm saying? With dispensaries, you know what I'm saying? Putting music in dispensaries, putting, you know what I'm saying? Getting sponsored by different, you know, brands and stuff. So taking it to the next notch, you know, maybe uh, getting this sports thing back going because my, my little brother Walker Murphy, you know what I'm saying, played for the Bills, played for the Saints, right? you know, the Jets. Man, you know I'd be saying? doing something, man, I'd be loving him if we can get the city together and let us, you know what I'm saying, bring bring that hoop it up back. You remember, well, you remember man, back? I got a table, I just, man. It's like, man, you remember, you remember man. back in the day when Dallas yeah. used to be really a hoop city. Remember when we used to go to the Wheatland and all that over there, you know what I'm saying, yeah. to the park, and everybody, everybody was balling, man. You go to Glendale, everybody was balling. My first yeah, hoop it up, man. My first say. hoop it up was out in the air. My yeah. first one. Yeah. Right up the street, up in the air. You know what I'm talking about? It was going, I'm telling you, like, back in them, that hooping part of the game, that's what made this city what it is. Like, sports and shit just. Man, the city was the hood, downtown. Football games and yeah. shit. Mm -hmm. Like that's what like that's what we were big on. Yeah. A lot of it died down. An exclusive. Uh, uh, uh. This a this breaking exclusive. I pulled some of the video. Oh man, this like, is man, up, this man. is man, this is underneath the bridge. Oh, hold up, man. Oh man, this is exclusive. Oh man, that's exclusive yeah. right here, y'all boy. This is all hoop it up. You know what I'm saying? I don't care if y'all can't but yeah, that's hoop it up back in the day. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, you see that there, there, baby? That hoop it up. Yeah, yeah, yeah. pull it some up. Man, you see that there, baby? Yeah, man. Yeah, man. And that's right downtown underneath the bridge. Yeah, y'all see that there? Yeah. Man, boy, you got that there. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Man, what do you consider yourself, man? man. What, what do you, man, what, what, honestly, what do you consider yourself? You know what I'm saying? Man, a pioneer, you know what I'm saying? A person that, that's real for one, you know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. Like, I'm like your, your, your people. Right, you know right, what I'm right, like, right. I'm, I'm, you know, I come from, like, I don't want no smoke. You know what I'm saying? But, shit. See, I gotta get down, gotta get down. Right, you right, feel right, what I'm right, saying? Right. Like, that's what it is. Like, that's the problem with everybody thinking we gotta come out. You know what I'm saying? Now, nah, nigga, make some paper. Right, right, right. You know what I'm saying? Like, I feel like, why put your, why, why not put yourself on papers? Then let these pecklewood put you on papers. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Going to probation fees, pro, parole fees. Court fees, all these different fees. You know what I'm saying? Let's just take that time. Like, like we save money from fuel. We save some money as a community. We make some shit shift back on them. They won't even know what the fuck to hit. Right. We hit them with another pandemic. Right. I, we done created a pandemic, a plan nah, gimmick. Nah, for real. You know what I'm saying? So, I just these movies and stuff, my nigga. Like, just being able to give some some real stuff. I like what Fifty Cent and them doing on the Snowfire. My little brother, shout out to Alejandro Beast Wilson. You know what I'm saying? He be putting me on a lot of movie games and stuff like that, and you know keeping me afloat. You know what I'm saying? So when I look at movies, I'm looking at how the camera rolling, how the, the scene is, the script that they wrote. Like I I just look at it different. I don't look at it just how like people like oh it's a good movie. Now I'm looking at the whole concept of it, you know what I'm saying? Right. So how I can critique that to be better on than what they doing, you know what I'm saying? And take it back and put it in your mix. That's it. Right. And so what so That's you shooting so now you getting into shooting films and, and videos and everything. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know right. So yeah, I'm just I'm just I'm just growing with my with my new love, you know what I'm saying? That you know, it's always been a, like you said seeing that that footage back Two thousand and one. Right, right. That, that's the foot like I, I incorporate that yeah, yeah, yeah. So, yeah. So I got I got stuff that I got to incorporate. So just building up a, a household, these brands with the uh with the name, uh with the with the companies that that's gonna uh help me get to the next situation, you know what I'm saying? And then putting the people that that, that they have the same vision, right. dream and drive underneath these companies, you know what I'm saying? I really and then another thing I like to be doing is <coughs> is getting these companies and um and flipping them companies. 
right. build them up and then sell them. You right. know what I'm saying? Like cribs, like, like this is like real estate, but right. like business. You know what I'm saying? I know how to do it. Yeah, build that equity up. Yeah, you know what put, I'm saying? And that's another thing. I'm trying to put equity and ethnicity and put it back into the black community to give it inheritance. Well, you saying yeah. you got that pimping in your yeah, way, yeah, 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 for real. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to put equity and ethnicity back into the community of the black inheritance. Nah, of, for real. That's yeah. real talk. Yeah. Uh-huh. So, we, so we can, you know, get somewhere. You know right. what I'm saying? I don't want nobody to like I want somebody to learn something new, you know. Every time I see somebody, I'm like, what you got going on? Oh, then they be, hey, shit, nigga, what you got going on? Well shit, I got shit. Right. You know what I'm talking about? Right. Yeah, that's what you I got. You know what I'm talking about? Like <laughs> make a nigga feel like, God damn, this nigga what you know what I'm saying? He finna come with all this shit and everybody be saying that, man, squeeze, you come with all this shit, yeah. And you know, and like, this this another thing that I was just trying to, you know, Get her, you know, not just get her, but I'm just saying, I earn my way up this bitch, you know. But already, already, it's like, yeah, 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 already. But go ahead and say yeah. what you came up here for. You know what I'm saying? To, yeah. to basically, you know, to to allow people to to get into the the new way of, of what I'm doing. Like when nigga, you know, a nigga look at you, what you got? What this nigga got going on? Who he got? But well, this is what I got going on, so much shit that I can't really talk about. You feel me? Yeah. You know what I'm saying? But it's 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 in that pot cooking. It's brewing, and y'all done got a dose of the medicine uh, quite naturally. You know what I'm saying? So it, it's it's in the mix like a twig. So I promise you. you know what already, I'm saying? already. I promise you. And I see y'all over there working. You yeah, know what I'm saying? Yeah. Trust and believe. Pre- you know what I'm saying? I see and you working. Yeah, yeah. And then when, when yeah. people shouting you out, you know you working. You know yeah, what I'm man, saying? So. Good, man. Pretty man, so man, so man, before we get out here, cause I'm gonna ask my question I always ask, but man, what the hell you got in this big ass box back here, man? Ooh, man, you got man, boxes man. everywhere, oh, oh, man. They got drink everywhere oh, and shit. Oh, man, 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 listen, listen. <laughs> I need that. It's it's really terrific. Let's go get the bottle that lean listens. You know what I'm saying? Instagram, go get that. My nigga, come on in, man. He, he been doing this thing. He, he stumping that period down in the game with this shit here, man. Y'all don't want to miss out with this shit, man. I'm, I'm finna go and pull up a little something. Man, pull up, man. What it tastes like? I'm, finna, I'm just finna pull up and give you the risk because I, I ain't going to do you like that. Oh, okay. I'm just yeah. saying what, 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 what kind of flavor I'm looking towards. This real Texas tea. Okay. Oh, <laughs> This real Texas tea. Oh. So you, I'm, I'm going to let you. Oh, what? that boy said that's that Texas tea, yeah. baby. Yeah, 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 yeah. Oh shit, nigga, what yeah, that t- nigga, yeah, what? <laughs> yeah, 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 yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, it's going down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That shit look dick over there, yeah, too, yeah, boy. Yeah, you, you, you don't get, get lost in that shit. I smell it, too. You know what I'm saying? Lean licious, nigga. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? I got, I got, I think I got to take something for the show, because you know what I'm saying? You can't, you know what I'm saying? Hold on, look. Like, Tell you keep that bottle, it's you, hey. You know. Oh man, we finna yeah, we finna get down in there. Yeah, yeah, man. I appreciate that tea for real. Yeah, man, you know, you know like, what I'm saying? Yeah, like I said, so you know I, you know, a lure uh in the soda and I've been doing you know, like footage for them, like putting that, you know, putting cinematography up into they they uh their business. Right. You know, the cigar lounge out there. You know what I'm saying? Just that from the low key tip. You know what I'm saying? But you know, he had a brand party there. You know what I'm saying? So they be having that type of stuff. So y'all should reach out to them if y'all got something y'all trying to do. And it's positive. You know what I'm saying? You want black people to support this shit. You know what I'm talking about? Go to some black people shit. You feel me? Yeah, you know, reach out to some black people. Out For there. real, cause they out there. They got, they got yeah. stuff. You know what I'm saying? Y'all walking right past it. You know what I'm saying? Going right into you know what I'm saying? Whatever, whatever. You know what I'm saying? But right. we, yeah, that's neither here nor there, there. You know what I'm saying? But anyway, okay. you, <laughs> you know how you know how they take it. Yeah. But um, you know, like I was thinking too. You know, like man, you know, I'm thinking about re- revamping the podcast a little bit, man. I, I don't know. I might probably put put a table some up in here and probably play spades yeah. or bring the spade game back. You yeah. know what I'm saying? Bet the money on the spades yeah. or the domino game going yeah, on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? Why yeah, you know? Why we chopped up? Pie. I got a dumb enough podcast too, so y'all stay tuned in. Dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They got the, you know what I'm saying? That's yeah. what I feel like, you yeah, know what I'm saying? Yeah, like, but, yeah, they need yeah. Them, but cause I mean, like, I can't tell you not to put no dumb numbers yeah, in there right. because 
how many cribs around this motherfucking hot neighborhood yeah. that's playing dumb notes that right. we don't even know about? We don't even know. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? But that's yeah. our culture. Yeah, man. I was just. Shags and dumb notes. Yeah, you, you know what I'm saying? saying? Or spades. You know what I'm saying? Book them, yeah, shook them. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, For yeah. real. Tonk and all Yeah, tonk and pity pet. You know yeah. what I'm saying? That's the whole thing. Oh, God. All right, man. Yeah, what you got back in there, man? Man, I got some stuff that, you know. Yeah, I see you got you. I got you. You got the oh, pearl. Oh, this three gas shit, right? Oh, this nine three gas. Yeah, you know, I got my nine three gas on. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, I got mine on. You know what I'm saying? Got boom. I'm in the. Yeah, I like that. You got that fresh patch on. Yeah. Patch over here. You know what I'm saying? So, yeah, Ken Folk froze, held it down with this bit. You know yeah. what I'm saying? So you got that one. You know, got bag. I see. I got the bag gang going over yeah, there. I, I brought something for you. Watching something to read, I know you. Man, that boy say, look. Uh, boy, look, 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 look. Yes. Look, he know, yeah. I yeah, see you. Yeah, I see yeah. you over there in the school. Yeah, I see yeah, you what? graduated. I see you what? got the thing going on. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Keep going I, I see you got your book. Yeah, he see we yeah. know we don't want to say. You know that's my boy. See that's why. That's why. That's why I fuck with T. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> Really? Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm why I fuck with T. I was just, on, I was just, I was like, man, this book right here, man, they know, they know better. They should have put a little bit more in this one. <laughs> but yeah, I got some good stuff out of there. Yeah, yeah me and Gator got a book club. Yeah, we okay. Let's talk about y'all got a book. You and Gator got a book club. Okay. Put, well, then we gonna try to put together. That, that, that okay. We're working on, you know. Okay, that's the bet. You know what I'm saying? And what, just like what gangster stories and or like hood stories? Well, you and, know, we're we able to share book knowledge. Okay. <laughs> like being able to, like say for instance, the book I read one that that helped me in life, uh, the art of communication. Mm -hmm. So you know, in this day and age, you ain't gotta read motherfucker. The motherfucker read to your motherfucker ear hole. You know what yeah. I'm saying? It tingle your earwaves. You know what I'm saying? It's some good shit. Yeah, and it's all it take. You know what I'm saying? So, so shit like that. You know, like uh, pick a book up. Uh, put the guns down, pick the book up, you know what I'm saying? So shit like this, you know, it's always elevating and vibing in, in, in the game, you know. I, I've been raising producers, engineers, rappers, sport uh, athletes, you know what I'm talking about, teachers, preachers, lawyers, you know what I'm saying? All these people, you know what I'm talking about, that, that, I, that I have brought up in the ranks that, that I've been doing for a while, that, you know, like been put, like been putting them in the mix for a while, doing my thing. You know what I'm saying? You know, like one that one that's going on right now. Uh, they got some going here. Product that producer, uh, Valentine Cruz. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to my nigga Cruz. Okay, but, Valentine. Um, yeah, right. whatever. He uh, he he's stopping their period now. And I, you know what I'm saying? He, he work hard. You know. Right. You know he uh he uh he a Spanish. You know, you know, miss, you know. Oh, yeah, I can tell by the Valentine. Yeah, you know what I'm saying? saying? But he, he got that work ethic, though. Right. Like youngster, you know, but he, he, he re, like, right there, come up out that steel clip, you know what I'm right, saying? Right, right. Motherfucking, uh, 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 Smokey Joe's and, and H&J's right on here in the middle of that shit. Okay. You know what I'm saying? So, but, so, he different, but, you know what I'm saying? He, he be misunderstood sometimes, but he let his work speak for himself. So, uh, really? so you know, that, that, uh, you know, that real, uh, that, that blow fly on, you know, it's a, it's a production by him, and we got this uh, Switch House project, project, too. That, uh, yeah, I know you yeah, talking about the Switch House project. Yeah, 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 yeah. I told you I had a little surprise for you. Yeah. <laughs> but, yeah, the Switch House project, you know, it got all these different people on there, you know. DJ Smiley, he, he on, on mine, you know, my project. Shout out DJ Smiley, yeah, man. You know, he don't get a lot of credit like he should. Yeah, 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 but, you know, you, like, you know, but my you cousin, really, but my cousin make sure she keep him alive, yeah. man. Shout out to my kinfolk, D with C. You know what I'm saying? The whole clique over there, you know Shout what I'm saying? Shout out to Yeah, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, hey, yeah, for real, for, for real. real. Like, that's my DJ, you know what I'm saying? So, he got a lot of knowledge and he hold a lot of, like, when you, like, you're gonna have to get them up for a man, you know what I'm saying, like, yeah, so you yeah, have to get smiley up he feels her. some type of way for one, you yeah, know Yeah, I'm gonna have to get you up smiley, man. But he, yeah. he, 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 his story. Like, yeah, man, like, yeah, I remember he had the store over there on, what was that, uh, Camp Wisdom? Mm -hmm. Yeah, uh-huh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. yeah, so, you know what I'm saying, niggas like that, man, they, you know, they, they challenge is to make you 
feel the vibe of what others have said and created. You feel me? So you gotta have somebody on there, um, you know, talking to from their point of view. Right. Yeah. All right, man. So, really? man, I appreciate you coming yeah. up here smoking this weed with me. Yeah, yeah, man. I, I said you barely man. got through your shit, man. Yeah, yeah man. It's shit, a double deck. Man, motherfucker, right there. <laughs> you had a flow. You know what I'm saying? If you was in my shoes, you know what I'm saying? What question would you ask yourself that I didn't ask you? Uh, what's something that you wish you would do that? What's, up, what's something you would do that? The world would least suspect of you, you know what I'm saying? Well, shit, what's something you would do the world would least suspect of you? All right, well, shit, let me tell you about it. Shit, I hope you ain't wearing no pampers on the block or nothing, my nigga. I'm clear, I'm clear. Oh, I'm talking about, I can already tell. I'm clear, I'm clear. I'm clear. I can already tell. I'm clear. 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 i like, no, no, square me. Straight up, like I won't even entertain this so much shit I got going on. I can't entertain. What is that? You seen Z the nigga? You know, like, my medication won't even let me take. She got love to me, smoke the motherfucking car. Hey, I mean, this, uh, not corn, but this, this, this uh, hog in the blanket. Yeah, that hog in the blanket. Show, it's like, this shit here ain't no corn, man. <laughs> hey, no, shout out to the corn smokers. <laughs> For real, because that shit, man. It's corn hustlers, not Nebraska corn huskers. You feel me? Like, for real. But going back to what, like, what you said, like, one of, one of my, like, I done did a lot of stuff, you know what I'm saying, in my mix and achieved a lot of stuff that took my standard. Like, I don't have to, like, the match don't have to know what I done did in the accolade, the accolade show what I did. But, you know what I'm saying, yeah, I, see, I, I hit that, that wheel of fortune. I'm trying to hit that wheel of fortune one time. Right, right. Like, it's something I, I want to do. Right. So I want to be one, you know, and, and not just get on that, you know, I'm talking about to win that bitch. You right, know what I'm talking right, about? Like, right. I'm trying to compete. Right. You know what I'm saying? Like, that's some real, that's some real shit, though, man. Like, people don't, don't know, and then, and then I could juggle. You know what I'm saying? So, you know, I could you know, I could do a couple things, you know what I'm saying, magic tricks and shit like this. I, you know, you know, see I could make an elbow disappear from the dance floor. You see yeah. what I'm talking about? <laughs> <laughs> but, <laughs> My nigga say he could make an elbow disappear from the dance floor. <laughs> Everybody in there stand alive with you know what I'm talking about. New, yeah, <laughs> My nigga say he can sell a shell, nigga, some shell toes. You know what I'm saying? Man. <laughs> Thanks to it. <win. laughs> you know what I'm talking about? My yeah, nigga yeah. over here spitting them LRPs. Nigga. Yeah, <laughs> that nigga's yeah. my nigga T Squeeze. Yeah, man, <laughs> man, yes, sir, man. Yes, sir, man. Hey, man, I'm, no, for real. Like, hey, my, yeah. Hey, my, hey, man, I'm trying to, you know, I, I, you know, I know that's another part of me that I, you know, that that's, that people love about me too. You know, what I said the word, the word play, yeah. just naturally. But you know, they come from like my 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 cousins. You know, what I'm saying like we bounce back and forth. Like right. My other cousin. You know, what I'm saying shout out to V Black. Shout out to. Uh, to uh, Seven Deuce, you know, said V Black, I ain't really talk about that part, but you know, like we experienced tragedy at an early age, you know right. what I mean? So, my cousin Corey right there, you know what I'm saying? I got him tattooed on the mix right here, you know, and him skin with it, you know what I'm saying? But he uh, he was a talent. He was like, everybody, you say his name, you know, but it was like in like 89, you know what I'm saying? So I'm speaking about a 15 year old. In '89, you know what I'm saying. And what's his name again? Corey Riley. Corey Riley. You know already. That, that was Moe and the Fro. They first cousin. As right. Like Slim, they first cousin. You know what I'm saying. My cousin. But but he uh he died of you know he got killed you know what I'm saying uh, over a bicycle frame back over there in the legendary apartment. But you know what I'm saying. I, I was like in the fourth grade. You feel me? So. That part of the game changed the nigga life at an early age, you feel me? Like niggas didn't know like was fifteen years old the the key key mark, you feel me? So right. so that that would help me like protect my brothers and make sure we have an avenue for ourselves, you know what I'm saying? My cousins, you know what I'm saying, like that uh, you you know what I'm saying? So yeah, uh, partners and shit like so that's that's something that 
Yeah, that's how it was yeah. growing up in Dallas. I can remember, I, I can remember being an elementary man, staying in Biscayne apartments. You know what I'm saying? We in elementary, man, come back, me and my partner. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. The sister, I knew everybody in Biscayne apartments. Yeah. My, and we stayed upstairs in the back. You come all the way in the back, you know what I'm saying? You park right there by a trash can, come upstairs. You know what I'm saying? When you come upstairs, you make that right. Now I'm the, I'm the uh, second door, you know what I'm saying, from the right. My partner, you can see him stay downstairs. Mm -hmm. You can see his, you can see his crib right there. It's kind of counter but it's right there from, from where we stayed upstairs, man. And I remember one night, one of these boys came through there one night. And I'm in that bitch, I'm going to Jefferson Davis. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? You know, and I seen them come through one night. Right yeah, that's true story, man. I seen them come through, me, my mama, you know, we just sat there and we just watched them just come through and just shit them. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. And I don't know, you know, I know they either came for the nigga uncle or something, you know, because I know that nigga uncle's out there bad, you know what I'm saying? And stuff like that. You know, ain't no telling this T lady, but I know, I know uh, T lady died and everything like that. Somebody else had uh, passed away, but I know I ain't no seen him. He, was, he came back to school, he was going to Jefferson Davis. If the dude know who I'm talking about, the nigga know who I'm talking about, he, if, if, if he see this podcast, he'll know. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, he had cradles, nigga, I'm talking about cradles in his leg coming to school and like, I was like, damn, you know what I'm saying? It was fucked up shit, and that shit, that shit, that shit changed. I seen a lot of deaths, so I know what you mean coming up. You know what I'm saying? I even seen my, uh, my next door neighbor kill his wife and put her in, in the back of the truck. You know what I'm saying? Like, shit. You ain't Karoo. <laughs> you know? Man. But, um, man, before we get out of here, man, I got, I know, I, I, I give me a Mo Week story and a Froze Only story, man. I just, I gotta give one of those, you know what I'm saying? You can slip a Gator Man story too in there if you want to. Uh, okay. Well, I could, uh. Uh. You put me on the spot, I'm gonna put you on the spot. So I got you, uh. Me and Gator, <coughs> so we be going hard on them dominoes, and, uh. Um, and, uh. He a real, real stand up individual. Right. And, uh, you know, uh, our future nephew, uh, you know what I'm saying? VP, you know what I'm saying? Like, you know, so I used to hoop with him too. So, and uh, but, uh, but Gator though, me and him, watch, you know, watched the uh, uh, Nat Turner. Uh, the uh, damn, what's the name? I was just talking about this. Uh, the, you know who Nat Turner is? But we watched the uh, the. Uh, was this TV? This a show they got going on right he now. He was a he was old. You know, he he killed like. Like fifty five white family and shit like this, uh, uh -huh. and then they they hung him, lynched him. So we, you know, so right before he, uh, you know, like he dropped Demi guy, you know what I'm saying? We, you know what I'm saying? Like, damn, you know, that Demi guy went right with that, you know what I'm saying? That, right. That, 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 you know what I'm saying? But he he was just the education of a gator. Right, right, right. He come from that, just came just off of it. Yeah, yeah. You know what I'm saying? His other studies, you know what I'm saying? Right. We watched something that we both learned some, you know, I can't uh I can't think of what that that, that show was Nat Turner uh, but but it, 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 that's what we watched. And then, okay. then Mo we uh That then we got hard. See the life of Moe we got see. Okay, see, the last, uh, the last time, uh, when, when his uncle, you know, Uncle Danny passed, you know what I'm saying, before, you know, that was a few years before, you know what I'm saying, like, we were, we were doing, like, he was, he was, like, he had his grandmama and he had Uncle Danny, and he was really, like, taking care of them. You know what I'm saying? Like they was sick, and, and right, you know, um, Daddy was dying or whatever. But he, uh, he was, he was taking care of uh, him. But he was rapping in the mid. So right. he, was, nigga, was down there like a, was was uh was uh like a bubble and shit. We, we, me and my uh, me and my kid for that. Uh, <laughs> nigga said nigga was a bubble. So, yeah, yeah. We be himself do call that nigga trans trans ambiguity. He was all over the place. But he was rapping and shit though. You right. know what I'm saying? He just hit the whole neighborhood. Just you know how he rapping, niggas just, just, right. he just that's, that was his performance. Right. Yeah. Like, so I just always just you know making kept him in his rim of, of rapping, and we used to rap. Uh, we were taking froze on the back home, rapping back and forth down lead belt, freestyle. So like ten, it, like when you say you're an expert, 
putting 10,000 hours into a freestyle and shit like that and rapping, like that, we, we expert in what we do, you know what I'm saying? So, so they got the expertise. Well, then kind of down by the hours. Yeah, yeah, it. yeah. Well, y'all heard it here first, yeah, man. Like, it's 365 days, you know what I'm saying? It's 24 hours out of the day. A nigga supposed to be working 8 to 12 of them, you feel me? The, the rest is on you. You know what I'm saying? Right. Yeah, for real. And remember, uh, Froze, uh, damn, what could, it's all in with this nigga, man. It, Cause he, cause that nigga, he a genius. Like Froze is like, like he very knowledgeable. You know right. what I'm saying? He, he, he got characters about himself. You know what I'm saying? Like right. he comical. You know what I'm saying? Like he gangster for damn so. You know what I'm saying? But he, 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 he humble. You know what right. I'm saying? Modest and shit. Like he don't really, he don't really like. I'm Froze. You know what I'm saying? He say my name right. You know what I'm saying? He, he don't really like. He don't carry himself like talking about like I hate like big like bump this in your Cadillac with you know what I'm saying with what's this what's this and that. He don't he don't do he don't but you know what I'm saying, but the way he you know worked his night through gas and um that you know what I'm saying, like shit a nigga did it just like it was a bump this in your Cadillac, you know right. what I'm saying? So and then the youngsters that that's coming up, you know what I'm saying, up under him, uh PJ Hammer, uh BSJ, uh, King, uh, PJ yeah, Hammer, yeah, yeah. my nigga, uh, 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 Blue Cheeto, and the rest of them, T Mac, my nigga T Mac, my nigga T Mac designed this, he'll he tell us the artist, he designed this right here, you know, said he designed this, he painted this shit, like, type shit, like, he'll he a, he a real artist, like, these niggas got a different kind of talent, you know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? But gangster though. He rapping this shit. The big DOA you got going on, but yeah, my nigga did this little man. Oh uh, really? You know, so he uh he rap like freestyling like that's what people don't understand. Like he he real crafty with that word. Uh he can I know what you talking about. Like a lot of uh so he got a lot of underground with me, but back in the day when we was uh you know, coming up and like I was telling you, exactly this is how we used to be at his, uh, his dad's house in the road. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Oh, Dunning Brook, you know what I'm talking about? And uh, we always, we, we were rapping, we practiced, like basically performing like the Jackson 5. Jackson 5. You know what I'm saying? Right, so yeah. we were really performing, but I pulled up on this nigga though. He had the orange, he had the orange pumpkin, you know what I'm saying? Ring cut yeah. down. So that was his, that was his, you know what I'm yeah. saying? So he, he, uh, he rapped that shit in, on one of them, uh, them uh, the uh, stampede on that on the on the stampede uh, song. But nigga, I came out came outside. You know what I'm saying? I had to we rap. I just right. jumped out and he just hopped out with the old, uh, with the stocking on the head. You know what I'm saying? Just jumped out and just zoned out. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> like I don't know where they tape it, but it's one of the coldest tape I ever had. But he just came out the crib like he just walked into it. You know what I'm saying? The, right. the flow. Right. And they were talking about it, you know what I'm saying? Pulled up in this punk, you know what I'm saying? Almost punk and shit like that. But Nigga, you got takes and takes. Y'all <laughs> in the booth for hours. Yeah. I seen y'all in the, what was y'all at? Big T? Yeah. Yo, y'all yeah. was there. <laughs> yeah. So, so, like, me and Fro did that one, uh, me and him did that, that uh, Blue Over Gray. That, that was, yeah. It was so monumental. Right. Yeah, that like, Blue Gray. Yeah, they, yeah it, uh, we, we dropped that bitch in, in, uh, in May, right? Mm hmm. In May, uh, it was snowing that in, in May, the day we had did that shit. That's crazy. In May, you in know May. it ain't probably nowhere near snowing. Texas, snowing. <laughs> Texas <laughs> in May, you know how I, I yeah. fucked up where it is, man. But man, I appreciate you coming out smoking. Yeah. What you finna show us? Oh yeah, let me. You, what you got, got over here? Hold yeah, on, man. I got the E-Connect bracelet, man. You know what I'm saying? And receipt books. <laughs> oh, you say got yeah, you make yeah, sure you get it. Oh, you getting all that. Yeah, black seed, uh, you feel? Oh yeah, that black seed, or oh yeah, that's something serious. Yeah, yeah that's square that business. Yeah, uh -huh. so, yeah, that's square business right yeah, there. Yeah, man, y'all y'all apply this in your life, you know what I'm saying? And the energy connection, bro, you know what I'm saying? It's at the circle swag stop shop, you know what I'm saying? 
Yeah. And, and what these places do is connect, connect it, you, connect it, you so to the mind, it, it, it store, it store my energy and yeah, stuff yeah, like yeah, that. You know what I'm yeah, saying? So it's gonna, it's gonna do that and keep you positive. Yeah, my boy No Shane, he got yeah. a store out there. He got them crystals. Shout he out to no Shane. One. It, yeah, you know Shout No Shane no got Shane. me. I got one of them things uh, like, yeah. on my on my keychain. You know what I'm saying? I need to go over there and check out the store. Give me some new stuff. I ain't been over there. I need to go, man. Shout out No Shane, man. You know, two times and that boy, uh, what's the name? Just dropped the dropped him an album. You know what I'm saying? Uh, classic music. It, yeah, it just came out. Yeah, it just came out. So I just want to say two times to you. You know what I'm saying? And um, yeah, shout out to all them boys. Man. You know what I'm saying? Shout out to the whole Triple D man. You know what I'm saying? Man, and I, and I like I like what what um you know like I've been seeing them boys out there too. Like I said, I've been doing the filming and this shit in the, in, the, in, the, in the um like the behind the scene footage. Uh huh. So you know, Uno Loso, you know what I'm yeah, saying? Lil Will, you know what I'm saying? Lil Will, shout out two times, Uno Loso, for real, for real. For real. Like, yeah, man, yeah. them boys out there, like, they, they, they stepping in, they, 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 they calling and, and um, putting it together, you know what I'm saying? Like, Houston got their culture, but I like the way Dallas is structuring, you know, it's culture and their culture back and recapturing their lane. Yeah, you know man. Saying? And everybody, you know, uh, I went to the ocean, the Pacific Ocean one summer after the pandemic, right? I seen this shit, I was like, damn, I ain't never been to no ocean. So I seen that every current was his own way right. to get to the shore. Right. And why uh, one crossing over, you know what I'm saying? Right. Drowning this way, drowning right. that way. Nah, hell yeah, nah. So we got to be like ways of our own, you know what I'm saying? Right. in our lane, like an ocean, you know what I'm saying? And, and flow with the flow. You know what I'm saying? Don't worry about this nigga, that nigga, that bitch and that hoe. You know what I'm talking about? Just do it you, you know what I'm saying? Be the best you, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Be the best you. And, and you know, bring love, you know, link up with love. I can't hear the link up with, with love, so you know, a nigga two time, he'll he preach it too, you know what I'm saying? G Cop, you know what I'm saying? He, before, like, Melvin them past and whatever the case was, back in them days, like, or right when that time, you know, it was, he had uh, promoters, artists, he had engineer, he had ball player, all in it at his sermon. And that message would link up in love, my nigga. That was like he performed. This right. nigga wanted to call his artist out that, that the circuit you got. Right. You know what I'm saying? But his message would link up in love. So if, if niggas start doing that shit, saying no, 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 no uh, gay, I just nigga that talking, they, they don't preach, they don't, nah, hey nigga, you need that shit in your mix, man. You can't be gangster 24 9, Jack. Right, right. You know what I'm saying? You gotta cut this shit off, and, and it's a character. Right. You know what I'm saying? Make the best man win, you know what I'm saying? And just don't step in no lane. Right. You know what I'm saying? Man, I, and I want to say shout out to, uh, Money Waters and uh, shout out to Money Waters, man. real to real, you know what I'm saying. Yeah, shout out man. to you know what I'm saying, Rifle Man, you know what I'm saying. Okay, man. You know for real, that's they they got they got some big coming out, you know what I'm saying. They got yeah. something that's really gonna look good for the city, man. And I yeah, and yeah. I feel like you know what I'm saying more of this should be coming out, right. you know what I'm saying. For sure. The city, like you say, they embracing the culture, you know what I'm saying. Because mm -hmm. we got a culture, for sure. Our culture mm -hmm. on deep, you know what I'm saying. Sweet. Like we got a swag, like no other, <laughs> you know what I'm saying. So it man, ain't even, like, it's just it, it, it's more than the dream. Man. You know what I'm saying? It's what man, it, it, it's say. Man, it's like, man, it's a way every, of life. You every, know what I'm saying? Everything <laughs> you look at, even to the to the, to, I got some footage that I of, of a homeless man or whatever his, his status is. But that's our people, though. You know what I'm saying? Right. Well, I'm gonna laugh though, cause she's funny. Right. That's a muscle. That's a that's a mood. That's a moment. You right. feel me? So I could be mad, looking at me mugging and shit like this, but. I can smile too, and that's the same emotion. But homeboy, man, say fam was out there. He sung, man. Right. We the nigga sung his heart out. Right. Tell it. And I see him all the time. You know what I'm saying? You feel what I'm saying? All like, the time. That's real Dallas. Right. That's real Dallas. Mm -hmm. You know what I'm saying? Nigga ain't got nothing, but right. but I want two dollars get get a donut and some coffee. You man, know what I'm saying? You know, Mo Week was like that. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Shit, you know, not to be shaming my nah, nigga or nah, nothing like that, but nah, my nigga nah, went through them trenches. Nah, for real. You know real. what I'm saying? He he like you know, you know, you know, for real. I'd like, picked him up off that curb. He wanted time. to be like that. Right. And then but like he also we like he had uh, Homes, I know. Uh, nigga, hey, come on, man, come on, you, come on. That's why I was just telling you, like uh -huh. he, he turned, like he, he fooled me because I thought he was finna do the right shit. Right. You know what I'm saying? Cause he did. He was doing. He was going the straight where he was doing the right shit. Right. You know what I'm saying? And then you know it just, it just what it was. But you know we love my my people. You know what I'm saying? My cousin. 
You know what I'm saying? He did some fuck shit sometimes, but you know, everybody got family members that do fuck shit. Right, all right, the time. right. You know what I'm saying? But you know what I'm saying? You, you could, like basically, I, I, we learn from him, from his mistakes. Right. So you know, this was the, that's the importance of a lot of this shit. Right. Learning from the, the mistakes. Right. And be doing better and showing others how to do better. Right. And bringing them up. You know what I'm saying? Nah, being, and I appreciate the advice you give my viewers and everybody out there. Oh, and man. everybody, I thank everybody for tuning in. You man, know what I'm saying? Y'all click them likes and subscribe, you know man. Y'all you know make saying? sure y'all share this. You know what I'm saying? Y'all yeah. make sure y'all get in that comment. You know what I'm saying? Everybody else, you know what I'm saying? Get up off the motherfucking monkey shit. You know what I'm yeah, saying? Stay yeah. lit the life and we about this. Biatch! Circulate, man. For real. To street shit, hustling out of Grand Marquis Caprice. People always told me I wasn't gonna be shit, but I always knew that I would be.